Greetings all, Danny here for Aquarius's daily oracle message. Aquarius, this weekend is a full blood moon lunar eclipse, and that is a lot of energy. It's also in the sign of Taurus, which is a very stubborn sign. So I wanted to give you a message from the Divine Abundance in case you felt called to do a casting or a releasing for yourself. The first cards I wanted to pull you towards is gratitude and guidance. Gratitude. Fill me with your gratitude for all you give. May I be a vehicle for you wherever I go. And when you do make this divine intelligence your foundation, you have a fixed star to follow because you are working with the divine to bring about the greatest and highest good for your life. And this will bring in great change. The ego finally sees the utter madness of trying to control everything, and you come to a sacred crossroads in your own evolutions. So this is the time to state abracadabra which literally means let everything that wants to go, go, and let everything that wants to come, come. Because you have to release energy for new energy to come in. Because think of it like a cup. If you try to pour something into a cup that is full, it is just going to spill over and run everywhere. You have to empty it out with sanctity. Through offering, even the most mundane problems can become sacrament. Offer to spirit that which bothers you. Offer to spirit that which hurts you. And in return, the gratitude that you have for them will bring about beautiful blessings and love. Divine source is the idea that no one person, place, or thing is your salvation. Only love itself. And you are love. Loss states that sometimes you learn true offering through loss. You make a passionate invitation for love to take over and bring in her plan instead of the egos. This is another time where gratitude is going to have a huge impact. Signs, your instincts are speaking to you. This is a message from the inner divine. So start listening, start heeding what they have to say. Self-love, let down the walls that you have built up to allow yourself to love the inner child like never before. Allow yourself to love the person that you were before. <laughs> Sorry. Receiving. Every day it becomes easier to receive the highest divine plan and to trust my inner guidance. Every day it will get easier. Every day you will trust yourself more. Every day you will hear your intuition more. Every day you will love yourself more. If you are making these conscious decisions to be grateful for what you have in your life now, be grateful for the development that you have made. Intuition and flow. Every person's road to the inner Lord is extraordinary and personal. How liberating to listen inside and sense moment to moment what is needed. Flow. Allow me, divine, to move in the flow and respond with peace and calmness. You are not going to be the pugnacious, angry person that's just bat banging their head against the wall. You're going to take a breath and look at the situation with a smart eye and let your intuition guide you to what needs to happen. You have faith and expansiveness. Miraculously, amazingly, everything that I need comes to me. Love is opening me to receive everything beyond my imagination. Expansiveness. Eternity is far more creative than the rigid constraints of an exhausted ego. True offering takes what can be an unbearable cross and returns it to love. And you will have companionship and liberation in this time. Giving someone your complete presence is an astonishing gift. Doubts and fears still come up. Don't You don't believe that they are you anymore. You are not your fear. You are not your trauma. You are not your anger. You are not your anxiety. You are love. And you are able to take control over your life and be the master of your destiny. To co-create with spirit, with the divine love. You are limitless and you are awakening your life. At, you are awakening from your life as a spiritual sheep. See yourself open to receive in the most miraculous ways. The divine can use anything and anyone to bring into you your, your blessings. So literally just open your eyes, open your heart and state, Spirit, God, give to me my blessings. Give to me what I am worthy of. And there is so much that you are worthy of. Divine love, guidance, companionship, connection, your divine gifts, intuition, intuit, guidance, non-duality. Let your authentic humanity shine forth while also bowing to the inner divine. You can become fluent at doing both. You're not going to sacrifice one part of your life because you're focusing on another. 
quite the opposite. By focusing on yourself, the rest of your life will have a huge ripple effect of change and beauty happening because you are focusing on love. You are focusing on healing and you are focusing on your connection with the divine. This is blessed. This is sacred. You are blessed and you are sacred, Aquarius. Never doubt your value and never doubt your worth. Have a beautiful day.